okay, I wanted to run through what to do if you get halfway or even most of the way through this and realize that maybe you added accounts where you didn't want them and it's messing with your budget. Your budget says you have $15,000. You're like, where the hell is all of it, right? And it's messing with your head and you just want to start over, right? You want to start over, but you don't want to have to change all of your accounts or all of your categories again. And you don't want to have to add all your accounts again. Here's how you do it. Come up to the top, click near your email address, click make a fresh start. Make a fresh start, it will tell you what it's gonna do. It's gonna keep your accounts and all of your links. It's gonna keep the balances and any of transactions that happened today. But your previous transactions are all gonna go away. Um, and all of your budgeted numbers, everything you put in budget is gonna go away, but your categories are gonna stay the same. So that's a fresh start. Now, if the only problem was that you maybe added savings into budget, but you wanna just track it, maybe you added this college savings in and you really wanted to just track it or a credit card, either one. The trick here is in order to take it off and move it under tracking, you actually have to delete the account. If you click edit on a, um, budget that has categories in it, it will say you can close it. Or if you want to delete the account, you first have to delete all of the transactions in the account, then delete it, then delete the account itself. If you simply close the account, it will ask you to move that money somewhere else. That's not really what you're trying to do, right? So instead, cancel, come into the account that you want to move to off budget, click all of the transactions, delete them, and then you can come in and delete account. Once you've done that, you can come in and what you'll have is an account that's already linked. So for example, this one, let's see if it loads, I'll say I want this one and it will have already what you previously selected, which was checking. You didn't want that anymore. Now you want it to be under asset because asset is just tracking instead of budget, right? So come down here, click asset and then click save. So now I, know I named it PayPal instead of savings either way. So just change it down to one of those tracking categories instead of a budget. That's it. But just remember in order to do that, you have to actually delete the transactions inside of that account first. So let's say this credit card, I have transactions in there, but I really didn't want um, it to be on budget. I don't want to have to categorize my interests or whatever. So I'm going to take all of the transactions, edit, delete, then I'm going to delete the account. Then I can add back the credit card, not as credit card on budget, but as a liability. Credit card, currently, balance is that, done. Now it's there, right? But it is not in my budget and messing with my numbers, right? Same thing here, delete your transactions. So this is a great way to do it if you don't want to have to, because even with the start fresh, if it's your first day, sometimes you start fresh and you still have all the same transactions and didn't really help anything. And so you can also just manually do this. Come in here, delete the transactions, delete the account, add it back in as an asset or a liability. And now I should only have the money that's actually under budget available. So rather than having that $15,000, I really only had the nineteen twenty-five dollars or the $2,000 that I started with to budget with, okay? If, while you're trying to start fresh, you also want all of these budgeted categories to be zero so you can really start fresh, see over here, reset budgeted amounts. Just click reset budgeted amounts and everything will go to zero. Now I happen to already have a transaction in here, so you know you can fix that, right? But that is another way to kind of get a fresh start without actually clicking make a fresh start. Either one of those are great options for you if you wanna start over. Remember, you can have as many little budgets as you really need, right? So don't be afraid to make a fresh start, delete everything and start over, it's okay. Do what feels good to you and what's gonna get you where you need to go.